we got here is a 2004 Toyota Sienna with uh, Toyota's 3.3 liter time and belt engine. It is the uh, 3MZ FE engine. We have a check engine light on this car. We have an EVAP code PO442, EVAP system small leak. That's a current code. And back out of that. Go to history codes. We have a PO306 cylinder six misfire detected. And we have a PO442 EVAP system small leak detected. Back out of that. Go to pending codes. We have the pending code PO442 EVAP system small leak detected. Common thing on a lot of your Toyota products, the P6s, Camrys included, is the hoses develop small cracks in them. If you look right on the edge of that hose, Okay, some small cracks as you leave that. More critical, there's a small crack right there. And if you look at the edge of your hose, you can see the crack goes all the way through. Quick tip on these engines, on your metal nipples here and here, not much of a problem, but on your vacuum switching solenoids, vacuum switching valves, and um, vacuum diaphragm boxes, they're plastic nipples, and these hoses get real hard and real brittle and become very hard to get off. What I like to do is spray them with a little bit of CRC and use a heat gun and warm the hose up a little bit. Uh, sometimes you can split them and they'll come off without breaking the plastic nipple on the hose. Just a quick tip on the Toyota engines, V6s, especially with a little bit of age on them. I think this car's got like 157,000 miles on it. Great running engine. So we're going to replace them hoses and uh, verify we don't have any leaks.